Hello and welcome to another tutorial brought to you by Trullo Design. Uh, what I'm going to show you now, it's a effect that I want to make it. I want to make a long time ago, about three years ago, when I saw the video of Justin Timberlake, Love Stone, and this is the effect that I'm going to make it today for you. Uh, this is what they made. It's, it's quite similar, if you see. Only three layers. I mean these three. And uh, very easy to do. I hope you enjoy it. So we start by adding an image with Justin Timberlake. Let me open it. Uh, photo remake let's see where the photo is oh. I think this let me find the photo I don't see it <laughs> Okay, this is the image. I'm going to open it. And I want to extract first the subject from the background. So I'm going to du duplicate the background. Okay. And I'm going to use the quick selection tool to select only what we need. like so and uh, I'm not going to go to refine edges because it will, it will be a black background we're not gonna see so much details so we are fine with this let uh, right click and uh, via a layer via copy and we have an image without without background so now we have to create a new layer and we have to have this layer above the subject so I'm going to fill it with black uh, back to the subject go to edit Oh, image, I mean, adjustments, desaturate, uh, image, adjustments, level, I want to be black like so, black and white, okay. Now we have to create a brush and to create this brush we're going to need a pattern before so I'm going to create a new file 50 by 50 okay create a new layer go to rectangular marquee tool and make I mean nah let me see control D to deselect we need a file 5 by 5 not 50 by 50 5 by 5 okay it's small I know but we don't need it that big so another layer rectangular marquee tool and make a selection on the middle like this fill it with black okay control D to deselect I make the invisible invisible the background go to file 
I mean image uh, define uh, pattern give it a name I don't know maybe lines like this okay uh, now we're going to create one more layer one more composition I mean uh, uh, new 100 1000 1000 okay and duplicate this layer and right click blending option go to pattern overlay uh, first uh, fill opacity turn off to zero pattern opacity go to and find this is the one that we gonna use we made it before the pattern uh, now you have to mess around with the, this setting here uh, 3000 300 it's fine for me I think maybe less not more uh, something like this will work okay um, make the background invisible so you have to have something like this now right click restrict layer or like restrict layer style and go to filter distort twirl and we have to twirl, twirl it again you, you have to mess around with, with the settings depends on what image you have so okay um, now go to image define preset brush, brush preset give it a name like lines this is the brush not the pattern so okay uh, back to our image let's see here is the image I'm going to duplicate this one duplicate okay and create one more layer where we gonna set the color and my color will be black black I mean a blue like this one okay uh, fill it make it invisible uh, let's see delete this one for now uh, we don't need it we need only one I make it three so only this one go to your erase tool right click we have to choose the brush that we make it for me it's this one and make make it big from here let's see here you can make it I see how big you need it something like that oh, is too too much. No, this is great. Okay, and make two clicks. Wait a second. We made it one already. So two clicks. One. Two 
and you're gonna have something like this after you erase so let me show what you have until now you have only the subject uh, erase it with the button that we made it but we made it brush so we can erase it and this is the easiest and the quickest way to create this effect okay let me turn off turn on the now we can duplicate it okay and make it overlay and no 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 again erase this on this one because we want to cut some of the lines here uh, like you see here again we have to erase it so I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to take this one choose another brush if I can't <laughs> choose one because my brush is too big and I can't work here wait so this one okay something like this uh, you have to zoom in a lot here now so race tool I'm gonna make one cut here like this let me make the brush a little big a little bigger so I can erase this part I'm, I'm going to make a one here again zoom in mm. here I'll make the one cut okay okay another cut here let me zoom in I don't want this round here so I have to make the brush smaller make a straight line there now we can erase like this okay uh, one cut here maybe and you get the point but I really want to show you how to how the effect will be after we're done here with the cuts so something like this maybe let me make one cut here okay I'm going to make one here like this and one more here and I'm going to make a long one from here to here so great zoom I I um, use more um, I try to make this effect with layer mask but I want to make something easy for you to understand 
is is great uh, to make easiest the easiest easiest way. So I think we're done with the cuts. You can make how many you want, depend on the what subject you work. So you can make one straight, one line, cut it. Let me show you. See like right, right here on the eye, it's a little bigger. So now, now we can duplicate this layer. Right click, right, right click, duplicate, and make the blending mode to overlay, and turn off the blue layer, and make it uh, soft light. And this is it. Now, if you see here on the edges some uh, white you don't need that let me show you on my pictures so we don't need that white there let me erase erase it on the boat layer or we can delete that one and with the hardness zero brush with the hardness zero delete this part right here like this. Oh. <laughs> okay. Something like this. Oh my. My piece is going to lag. Oh, 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 I take the air off. Okay. I'm using the keyboard, I mean, uh, Control Alt Z to undo. Now, duplicate it again and turn it to overlay and this is it mine is much blacker this is much much whiter but you get the point thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share see you later bye bye